tutorial. Today's topic is the Cold War mod. Well, as you guys know that the Cold War mod was available in the Steam Workshop a couple of years ago, but for some unfortunate reason it was removed. But the mod is still active, uh, development is still going on. The authors of the mod are updating the mod with new stuff um, very often and the current version, the latest version is 1.7.2. So some of you guys are struggling to find the appropriate website to download this mod as it is not available in the Steam Workshop anymore. So the best place to download this mod and to find updated versions of the mod is the Cold War mod group in the, your Steam. So there's, there is a link of this group in the description. Go to the link and join this group. Join this Steam Cold War group and then go to announcements. So here in announcements they will post the update uh, and download links of the new update. So scroll down and you will see patch 1.7.2. It was uh, posted here on 23rd February. So yeah, a couple of months ago. And here we have all the download links you guys are looking for. So you guys don't have to uh, browse on websites which some of you think is virus or something else. So here we have Yandex the link, Google Disk, Yandesk Torrent, uh, Google Disk Torrent. So this is Torrent Download and this is Torrent Download for Yandesk Disk. Alright, so those of you who want to directly download it, uh, click on the Google Disk and if you guys want to download it via torrent then click on this link uh, english localization pack there's also two links yandesk and google all right english localization torrent link so every link is available choose your appropriate download uh, let me show you just click on cold war 1.7.2 google disk and click on this one continue to external site it's totally safe then uh, this Google Disk website will pop up and what you guys will do uh, yeah so just click on download so here is the link uh, Google Drive can scan this file ignore this this is not a virus because I already have the mod so this is 7.5 GB download size and all you have to do is download after downloading go to your men of four soul squad 2 uh, extract the file and then paste it on your mods folder over here cold war 1.7.2 this will look something like this and another one is cold war english for english localization then what you have to do is go to in-game options and then activate these two mods together. Alright, all together. App uh, activate them and apply them. And then just enjoy. And if you uh, want to download even the latest version that is 1.7.3 and further versions, just uh, follow this, uh, subscribe to this RSS feed and then you will be notified when the developers post another announcement on this group. So this is the safest and the most easiest way uh, to find and download the latest version of the Cold War mod for Man of War Assault Squad 2. Another thing before asking, this version 1.7.2 works with the latest Menafor Steam Edition. I'm not totally sure if this mod will work on older version of versions of the game. Alright, so I have the Steam version of the game, so my game is updated to the latest version and this mod works smoothly on the latest version. So 
try using it on older versions at your own risk and some questions will arrive on the comment section no this mod will not work in call to arms all right so if you want to ask this comment uh, listen to me this mod will not work in call to arms all right so this was the tutorial for finding and downloading the Cold War mod for Mana for Soul Squad 2. So this was highly requested and this is it. So guys enjoy the Cold War mod with my Delta Force mod and Desert Combat mod. So here, um, here they are. So you guys can play this mod with the Cold War mod the desert combat mod this is about the gulf war and you guys can also enjoy the delta force black hawk down mod by me uh, currently this one needs 1.7.1 but i will be updating it to 1.7.2 in a few weeks currently i'm busy with other things all right so that's it for today's tutorial hope this video helps a lot of you guys download and play the mod and I'll be happy to make more tutorials if you guys want just comment below what do you guys want to know all right thank you guys for watching I'll see you guys next time